All right, welcome back to the Silesia Build a Nation. Let's try something a little bit more standard, more kind of typical football manager content, less skits and just more straight up kind of gameplay action. So last we left off after our horrible, horrible performance with the national team. I was out sick, so, uh, you know, the assistant manager took over and we lost Northern Ireland and Slovenia. And that leaves us in a real precarious situation heading into the next couple games. So that'll be next episode is the game against Finland. Huge game there, but for now, let's look at... Uh, where we're at here with Slesia. Last game was Piast Zmigrod, which we won that one. After that, Gornik Polkovica, away game 2-1. to one. Robel, center midfielder, and Serpina, the left wing back, got us two goals. We gave up a penalty, ended up sneaking away with the 2-1 win. Then this next one, just a real kind of bad all-around performance. We were lucky to be up early. It just felt like we were going to bleed goals late in the game. That's exactly what happened. 2-1 loss. And then just an absolute goal fest against Kluxborg. 6-3. Pavel Wojciechowski, our striker. At the beginning of the season, you know, this guy's 33 years old. His contract's expiring. I decide, you know, we'll give you, you know, the max contract with some add-ons and things like that. Just for one year because I can't find any strikers who are even remotely close to your level. You're well-rounded, you know, hopefully your physicals don't drop off. And so far, he scored one goal outside of that last game where he had four. And he's been on and off injured, so hopefully he gets to be a little bit more consistent. But he does score four goals in this game. Oh, Pavel. Roman Horesh grabs one. And then the left back. Left back who I'm retraining as a center back. Colossa picks up a sixth goal. Six to three. We'll take the win. And then Petrkovica kind of just shut them down defensively. Played a pretty good game. 2-0. Uh, so another good second division win. That moves us, boom, to the top of the table tied with Pias de Schmigrod. Plony of have dropped off a little bit. It's looking pretty good for us, though. Top of the table. Today, however, we do play in the FA Cup against third-placed Miege Legnica, who could give us some issues there. It looks like they're in okay form. They're, you know, third place. They beat Gvarek, who was a third division side in the first round, second round, rather. So that's who we're playing today. And that's the only one we're going to do today. And then it's going to be off into the all-important, massively, massively, hugely important game against Finland. So I still have squad selection to do, and we still have some injury issues, but we'll talk about that after the game. Right now we can go ahead and jump in with this Miege Legnica game. It is away. No, it is home. So... We're going to go a little bit cautious just for this next game. Stick with our standard sort of system. Some, some guys are kind of tired. So I think we're going to bring in... Um, we're going to bring in Samietz, who's a 40-year-old center back who has no pace. He can play left back too. But, yeah, this is kind of my main center back on the left side. So Klaus is going to come in, just because Serpina is so dead. Uh, up top, Horesh is kind of dead. I think we should start. Oh, shoot. Do we have him? Wait, what happened to Marchevka? Oh, Marchevka's here. Yeah, let's start Marchevka. And Trachek can come in on the bench. He's normally a starter in the midfield. Uh, Pizarchuk, you know what? We might take Pizarchuk off. Actually, we're going to drop him 
down and then bring Musiala came on the right wing. And that's looking kind of okay. Fitness levels are decent. Subs are all in. We need to play one under 21 player. It's going to be Warzhiniak. I've warmed him because his recent performances have been pretty bad, but we're just going to go with that. I'm expecting us to just crash out right here. So we'll see how it goes. Yeah, I don't really know what I'm going to do with the skits and stuff like that. We'll continue the lore going a little bit. I think it's kind of fun, but maybe I don't want to hypersaturate it. And I'd like to kind of kick this save off a little bit, you know, get moving down, down into the future a little bit, see how Celesi really does. But I'm really excited about the chance to actually qualify for the Euros. So if we can win that game against Finland, then that'd be fantastic. But here we are at home playing against our brick wall. You love that. The brick wall is on that side and the crowd is on this side where you can't see it. I think they would have flipped that in the engine, but... Match engine things are a FM 2025 problem. Zemwo. Fiak takes a shot. It's wide. Nowak is back. Our goalkeeper who was out for a good four weeks. So good to have him back because Sobolevsky, the backup, was not getting the job done. No wax snags that one. Oh, excuse me? Did we just give away a penalty? Who was that on? Who was that even on? Dubrovsky? Kolasa? The left back? Did he shove him? I didn't see it. Not a good start. Trant. Nowak dives the right way, but we're down 1-0. Oh, Prize money isn't huge. So. It's not a huge loss if we can't perform here, but I would have liked to make some sort of a run. Tough draws, though. That's how these things work. We are doing nothing. So balanced. Yeah, press that guy. There we go. Magdiak. Musialik's in a good spot. From the training ground here. Penalty for us now, maybe? Colossa? Samia? Colossa! Ooh, good hit. Good hit. Koska, didn't I already say press that guy? Yeah, press that guy. Let's go. Robo in the corner. We always go near post. Colossa trying to make up for his earlier penalty. Wachowski's in a good spot. Finds Warzhiniak, and we have leveled it. There we go. All right, Warzhiniak, or um, Wachowski has provided as many assists now as goals this season, so does do that a little bit more often, usually providing to his strike partner Horesh, but here, Morzhaniak picks the ball out from underneath the defender of Zemwo, and it's 1-1. Now we encourage. Oh, Robel, he can hit these. Ooh, I thought he did hit that one. It was just over the crossbar. 1-1, I like it. Sessions all us. Yeah, we can do that. All right. They have done nothing. They have a penalty. That's all their XG. This game's all us. You're doing well. See, I got a little bit of a tickle in my throat. <coughs> Excuse me, a little tickle in my throat. Ooh, dangerous back pass. Don't like that one. Wachiachowski, though, is in space. Can he find Marginiak? Nope, that's the end of the highlight. Wachiachowski is doing some work, but the old legs are kind of showing through. His strike partner, Marchevka, is on a 6.5, so that's not helping. We win that second ball. No, we just wide open, parting the Red Sea, and Stanklick puts up 
Miage, two to one. Damn. I mean, this was... Like, let's show a little fight to get the ball and get back. Hey, eh? Magdiak? Yep, Samyats isn't looking too good at center back either on a 6.4. Zarkchuk's dead. Corner, here's our chance to hit him back. And we do through Colossa. It's 2 all. I'll make a few changes here. Um, I think Pizarchuk's kind of dead. So Afonso's going to come in. Uh, Kalinski's not really doing a whole lot. So I think we bring in... I'm sure we can bring in Tragic. And then that's probably good for now. I wasn't expecting the high score in 2-2 here, but Colossa just picks out the space. Rises. Nods it down. We got ourselves a game. No highlights are just gameplay, so I can't really manipulate the tactic based on what I'm seeing. We just get to watch goals today, I guess. Archevka hasn't done anything today. Musialik. Archevka, now's your chance. Find him across. Wachichowski. Ooh, it is blocked. Goes just wide. Wants to play for set pieces. We have scored both of our goals from corners. Mags Diak gets it. Three to two. Schleza beating Miege Legnitsa at home. Was not expecting this. Especially two goals from corners. Because I don't think we scored many goals from corners. Sure, we've had one. At least. There's a good chance, though. Musialik. No. Nope. Gabriel Afonso at the corner of the box. Drives in, takes the shot. Gabriel Afonso, not the goal scorer that you would want in that position. But I'm liking where we're at right now. I'm hesitant to change much of anything. Robol. Oh, it's... Oh, if Marchevko could have got that header. Goalkeeper was out of position. Musialik lifts. Magdiak. Their goalkeeper does not know what he is doing right now. And you know what that means? Shoot on sight. I rarely do this. It is all us in the second half. What is happening? Can we work this one from the training ground? Little pass here, pass here. Or just take the shot. Make sure to waste time, though. That's what we absolutely want. Takes the shot. That deserved to be a goal. That deserved to be a highlight. I don't know about a goal. Looks like he was going to miss, but... Was a save in the end. Another one! Colossa, it's 4-2. A hat trick of goals from corners? I've never seen this. Thank you, set piece coach. Oh, my set piece coach, by the way, has like one or two set piece coach attribute or whatever. So this is pretty exciting. Let's close this game out now, yeah? So we'll go winger, support that, cautious. We're going to drop the lines a little bit. We're going to lose the corner. Uh, counter. We'll do this. That's fine. Drop you in. And... Yeah, I guess we just bring on... We can make two more stoppages. Serpina's anxious. So he's not coming in. I suppose Murat. For Ro but Robo's just been bossing it. Then we bring on Horesh for Markchevka. Drop you back to support. 
and then we'll make we'll, we'll take out Warzhiniak. I mean, Robles just been crushing it. Can he score another one? No. It's four to two. How? I was not expecting this, but I'll take it. So we'll only get two k for the playing fee for the round. You get the money when you lose the round. I mean, Lignitsa, you guys need to work on your defensive corner routine because it looks like you don't know what the heck you're doing. Uh, last bit, Warzhiniak coming out for Igor Vanda. Must be a less, oh, at least one Celes. Oh, shoot. Okay, that's fine, Robo. You can come out. Swap it up for Tragic. Bring in Murat, because Murat's under 21. And then there's no way. There's no way they claw back two goals. Famous last words. Don't mind the squeaky chair. Straczynski plays it forward. Lignitsa need to put numbers forward here. Back. Looking out wide. They do get numbers forward. They cross it in. And they have grabbed one back right away. Nowak threw his hands here. It's four to three. And if we end up in extra time, I'm not going to be happy. That's Samyets again, who's not having a good game. I'm going to fire him up. This is always a bad idea. Vanda, here we go. We're good at corners. Let's make it 5-3. Please be our highlight. Vanda plays it back. Colossa, take that hit. There we go. There we go. Waste your time. Waste your time. Boom. Who's this? Regroup. Let's go. Let's go. Waste time. Come on, Gabriel Alfonso. No hurry. No rush. Colossa. It's over the bar. One minute left. We're through six minutes of stoppage time now. Can they get one more chance in? Crosses it in. We head it away. Don't let it go out for a corner. That's time. They can't take the corner, and we go through, and we have taken our first big Silesian scalp at Schleza. We just beat Miege. Lignitsa. Uh, everyone thought we'd get beaten, but we proved them wrong. Robel, nice, nice job with the corners there. Did really well. And Colossa, that's what I'm talking about. He gave away the penalty and came back like that. That's good stuff. Whew. All right, 2K, like I said. Uh, when's the draw for the next round? Tomorrow. So if it's before squad selection for the national team, I won't do it, but we'll see. And then, like I said... For the third round, you just get 2K. If we would have gone out, we would have got 25K. But now we're going to the fourth round. We'll get the appearance money of 2K and at least 50K. So that's awesome. Uh, send the assistant to go take care of that. Colossa. Beautiful job. Beautiful job. Boom. Loving it. Assistant coach, he's delighted. They loved what he said. I loved what he said, whatever it was. Um, the squad needs to be decided. We'll get to that. Let's take a look at the cup draw, and that'll be it for the day. All right, looks like a couple big boys in there. A couple little minnows as well, though. So hopefully we can uh, get some luck here. Katowice wouldn't be bad. Schlosk, our, you know, cross-town future rival. That would be cool. All right, Premier League teams play each other. It looks like we're home again against Zagwebia Lubin. Who's in? So we beat third place in the Premier League, and now we get to play second place in the Premier League. My luck just keeps 
It just keeps on keeping on. That game isn't for a little bit yet. It's like that's our last game before the winter break. But we've seen how where we're at in the table. We're looking good. We've seen what a standard sort of episode could look like. About 20 minutes long. Next up, it'll be squad selection for the national team. We do still have some injuries, obviously. Um, Camille Grabara should be back, though, goalkeeper. We just take a quick look at the national pool. Grabara should be back. Milik's back. Zelensky's not fit, but he should be just about back. Probably not for the Finland game. Maybe if we really need him. Piatek should be back. Hate is out, injured though. So that sucks because he's been a fantastic center back for us. Kaminsky's still out. Four weeks and two months with this broken ankle. And then we, you know, we lost Pavlenka, the backup goalkeeper. Like, I don't know. This next game against Finland is huge though, so. We'll see you at that one. Thanks for hanging out. Rock on Silesia.